Hello guys, welcome back to another Circle Lounge Isolation Creation video with your boy Willy, that's me. And today I'm going to be making a another classic, uh, but you might not have heard it, so maybe an unknown classic. Uh, I'm making a, a honeysuckle. It has in it lemon juice, orange juice, rum or gin, and honey as well, and that's, that's it really, there's nothing else to it. So if you're using a light rum, it's called a honeybee. If you're using a Jamaican rum or a Caribbean rum like I am, it's called a honeysuckle. So that's what I'm going to be making today with the chairman's reserve. If you're using gin, it's called these knees. It was thought to have originated in America during the Prohibition era. It was later reported on that it was a growing trend in Paris in 1929. The person who created it was an American socialite and philanthropist called the unsinkable Molly Brown. And the reason why she had that nickname was because, it's got nothing to do with booze, is because she was a survivor of the Titanic. Oh, a fun little fact for you there. Well, I'm not making a bee's knees with gin, I'm making a honeysuckle with rum. So first things first, I want to get some orange juice in there. 15 ml of orange juice. You don't have to use freshly squeezed orange, but if you've got it, use it. After that we want 20 ml of lemon juice. Let's see if that's that. And then we want three or four spoons of honey, depending on how sweet you want it. So honey is a really good alternative to sugar syrup and stuff like that. And mix all that up. You want to mix it at this stage because if you try and mix it just by shaking it, that ice will make it go even thicker. Now for our gin or rum. I'm using rum today. Rum has one. 50 ml in there. Get your ice in there. Shake away. Frosty, frosty, frosty. It's usually served in a coupe style glass, but this is the most kind of small rounded glass that I have. Or I just fancied a change from Martin. Strainer on so to leave out that ice, and strainer on to get that pulp out. You can already see that colour is really, really nice. Honey that's giving it that really nice golden colour. Bottoms up. Mm. That honey is so good, isn't it? It's not too sweet because it's not sugary sweet, it's just I mean, honey. You can't just like go, power, yeah, and there's the rum as well. It just all mellows nicely together. If you really want it to go fancy with it, you can also top it with champagne or prosecco, and that becomes an airmail cocktail. I don't have any, so, but I'd love to know what it's like, so if anyone's making one out there, let me know. So there we are, a honeysuckle, or a honey bee, or if you're using gin, the bee's knees, or if you've added prosecco, the airmail. So you've got four different cocktails there, if you like. You're welcome. Four for the price of one video. Cheers now, where everybody knows your name, all hail, Ted Danson, he's got his own little spot now, like that, you've got drink, him, Ted, our Ted.